Through the restarts and battles in the last lap, how much were you watching the number 21 car? Oh, well, the restarts were... I, I, I thought, on the, actually on the last restart, I thought, you know what, I might want to start up top, but um, my car was pretty good on the bottom. Um, Brian's a tough competitor, and he's, uh, he's proven that he can win these races too. And I uh, just uh, can't thank uh, Kyle and Justin enough for giving me this opportunity. And uh, Steve and, and Scotty and Andrew, they worked really, really hard all winter long. Uh, they had a really short winter, honestly. It was uh, a mad scramble for those guys to make it to Florida. And, uh, these last uh, two weekends, having having those weekends off has really, really helped our team. And, um, you know, they made some changes to this cool car, and, and uh, tonight was uh, finally paid off for all their hard work. So uh, this win's definitely for them. Um, you know, I, I wouldn't be here without all those guys and, and all of our great sponsors, Enios and, and American Born Moonshine. And, oh, there's so many people that help us out. Uh, Parker Store, uh, FK Shocks, uh, Rider Engines. Uh, like I said, cool chassis. Everybody um, they did their part tonight, and it was it was pretty rough. I think I was on two wheels more than I was four sometimes. <laughs> but uh, it's so hard to, to dictate your speed sometimes when you get to lap cars. And and um, I thought, you know, the one caution when I was in heavy lap traffic, I didn't think that hurt, that helped me. I thought it was going to hurt me. You know, Brian's pretty tough on restarts, so it all worked out for us. And and uh, very happy to get our first win this early in the season. And, and uh, hopefully it's, uh, 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 you know, we, we keep this momentum up for the rest of the year. Well, thank you, Shane, and let's go find You had a good run tonight. This is going to build your confidence into tomorrow. Yeah, 100%. You know, it's uh, pretty treacherous out there. Just uh, want to congratulate Shane and all Larson Marks racing for, for a good win there. And I was beside him there a couple times in one and two, and I just didn't think I was enough, you know, up front of him there to chop him, and just uh, gave him enough room, and he did what any professional did, went on across. And, uh, just uh, proud of everybody, you know, FVD, Casey's General Store, Print Place, Impact, MC Power, Champion Oil, uh, Charlie Garrett, engines really worked hard on our engines all, all winter long, and, you know, it, it shows. And, you know, Chad Morgan, uh, Josh Hemby, my wife Heather, everybody at our home that, that supports this team, and, uh, it's FVP night here tonight and tomorrow, so we definitely want to try to get one spot better. But if we left Missouri and told us, hey, we could run the top three of the Outlaws on the first night, we would have took it. So uh, just uh, don't know really what I could have did different. Maybe just uh, maybe got a little bit better of a start or maybe protected my line there on the beginning. But just proud and just uh, come back tomorrow and try to get one more spot better. All right, congratulations, Ryan. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a great effort by the whole Modern Motorsports team. and. Uh, I like racing here, and we've been sitting out for a couple weeks, so it's nice to get behind, back behind the wheel and bounce around on one of these things. They're a lot of fun to drive, and uh, we had a good car. We actually, I felt like uh, they wouldn't have had that yellow with about 9 or 11 to go. We were coming, and um, the bottom of 3 and 4 was coming in, and the 2 and the 21, I don't think realized it was there. They didn't need to. They had a good race going on, so, um, and then lap traffic was pretty good, so. You win them and you lose them that way, but uh, definitely a great effort and we'll come back tomorrow and try